Ryan, it's just you and me. Go on, tell me the rest. He would hit us and call us. Do I have to say those words? No. I tried to be a good girl, but the more I tried, the more I kept messing up. Let's talk about your bruises. Where do they come from? I deserve them. I took a sip of water without asking. I hadn't drank anything all day. He wouldn't feed me when mom went to work. He said it was my punishment for being such a burden. He said mom has to go to work to feed me. So if I stopped eating, mom would be home and he wouldn't have to hurt me. Ryan, you never deserve for someone to put their hands on you. Did you ever tell your mom he hit you? I don't remember. It's okay. You can tell me the truth. Yes. And what did she do? She said she did what she had to. Hmm, we should go. Your foster family is waiting to meet you. I'll take uh, Georgia Brown. What you know about that? I know a lot about different things. Hi, I'm Michael. I know exactly who you are, Mr. City Councilman. I follow politics. Now I know how it feels to have a stalker. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, you must be magic. Beautiful woman like you doing it in a place like this all alone. Oh, I'm not alone. I'm meeting a client. Bar closed in 10 minutes. What is it that you do? The Johnson. Excuse me? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so used to talking in medical jargon. I'm a pharmaceutical rep. So you're a drug dealer? <laughs> yeah. The Johnson is a medication that's been assigned to me. So I visit different doctor's offices and persuade the doctors to prescribe the Johnson to patients with AFib to slow down their heart rate. Hey. Oh. in five minutes. Is your client still coming? My client's already here. What do you mean? Well, the mayor hired me to meet with you because of that tape you have with him and that developer. <laughs> Them damn cameras everywhere. The Johnson. When given in a large amount, it'll slow the heart rate too fast, putting that person in cardiac arrest. 